Happy New Year everyone. So New Year, New Day, New Job and this time we have a HP Lite Book 840 G5 laptop motherboard and it's came in repair and that uh, does not turn on. So now I will try to fix this board. So let's try to fix it. Okay. Okay, uh, this is a motherboard part number. So this board is no power condition so now uh, i will uh, first of all i will check both power rail 19 volt and 12 volt uh, impedance so i set my multimeter in tired mode red prof to ground and i will check with this black prof so this is a 19 volt uh, current sense resistor so i check here and as you can see this line is perfect then I will check in this pad this is a 12 volt or I can check this current sense register for 12 volt so let's check here and uh, this also perfect so this two rail there are no <coughs> short circuit so now I will check 3 volt always 3 volt and 5 volt always voltage so this one 3 volt and this also perfect and this one 5 volt so this rail also clear no short circuit we uh, check this uh, 19 volt power rail 12 volt power rail 3.3 volt power rail and 5 volt power rail those all the rail is clear there's there are no short circuit so now i'm going to plug it in and let's check the condition of this board So uh, as you can see as soon as I plugged in white and orange LED it's continue blinking it's stop then blinking again stop blinking again it's so let's check some required voltage so it's uh, I will start from 19 volt so as you can see 19 volt is clear present and it's perfect let's check this uh, 12 volt we have 12 volt present and it's perfect next I will check this 3.3 volt this also perfect 5.2 volt it's also good so we have uh, 19 volt 12 volt 3.3 volt and 5 volt always all the voltages are present and it's perfect then I will check 3.3 volt suspension or uh, secondary voltage so this is a 3.3 volt secondary IC and this is a 5.2 volt secondary IC so now I will check this voltage first and as you can see we got only 1.3 volt but it should be 3.3 volt so let's check this voltage or this IC under my microscope. So this is a secondary IC. And we got 1.3 volt in this output for this IC. This IC output here input 3.3 volt is present and okay and this IC has the two level voltage so this voltage as soon as I will plug in this voltage will available here this voltage available after turn on this motherboard so this is enable pin and this signal name is KVC power on so let's check this voltage we have 3.3 volt KVC power on voltage is present and perfect but output only 1.3 volt so in this case I will check first the impedance in this rail secondary line then I will replace this IC set my multimeter and the branch Let's check here showing 1.4 something right okay it's clear there's no short circuit it's also clear So now I'm going to replace this IC.
This is my Donald Vogt. I have lots of Donald Vogt. Okay, it's done. Let's clean this. I see. On the flex. Okay, it's the good. So let's plug in again. And it's turned on. Look at my power supply. It's turned on and blinking is off. We can see the orange LED. It's glowing. <coughs> and let's check the voltage. Now we have 3.3 volt present the secondary side hmm. okay so let's check the display as i always check it's plugged in and it's turning on We need to wait for a few seconds. It will restart one or two times. Come on, baby. Okay, we have HP logo. So we successfully fixed this motherboard. It was really very easy. So I hope you all are enjoy this video. If you like this video, so please hit the subscribe button, press the bell icon if you already subscribed my channel. Thank you so much. See you in the next video. Until then, stay well. Bye bye.